London in this race, and we've got the championship record holder, Evgeny Trushnikova as well. This is Liesl Kaus of South Africa. Don't have a personal best or a season's best for her, so she's very much a mystery runner. She gives us a wave anyway. Here's the American, Sabre Hawks. Takes a deep breath. Again, her personal best, 114, so she may be quite a way behind the others. This is the lady to watch, won the gold at London 2012. Personal best, 105.86, Neda Bahi of Tunisia. Evgenia Trushnikova holds the championship record set back in 2002. Victoria Kravchenko will also be in with a shout of the medals, 107.32. And I sat behind this lady on the bus on the way in this morning with uh, her parents, I believe, Matilda Torstein Dottier, so the daughter of Torstein, so I imagine the man with her was Torstein, and her mum was there as well with a couple of Icelandic flags, quite a small Icelandic de uh, delegation here, so confirmation that uh, the Aussies again hold the world record in this, but not competing in the race, Brad. Yeah, well, I think uh, Lisa's retired now, mate, yeah. but uh, yeah, it's a good world record and who knows, it could go here. It's just your coaches that go on forever, is it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, Liesl Howes of South Africa on the inside, then it's Sabra Hawks of USA, Neda Bahi, the gold medalist from London, Evgenia Trushnikova, the championship record holder, Victoria Kravchenko and Matilda torsten Dutier. Very quickly away, it's uh, Trushnikova of Russia. Kravchenko going very well in the blue of the Ukraine. And it's Kravchenko moving away. And coming up is Trushnikova and Bahi. Bahi making ground now on Trushnikova. Bahi going very well indeed. Kravchenko beginning to tie up in the blue. And it's Bahi. Neda Bahi of Tunisia, who now, as the stagger unfolds, is already ahead. Bahi. Then it's Trushnikova, and then it's the Ukrainian. And Neda Bahi looks to have this one already. She started very well indeed. She was very impressive in winning gold in London. She's got a personal best of 105.86, and she's leading the Russian round here. Neda Bahi of Tunisia. It's Neda Bahi from Trushnikova of Russia. Trushnikova is going to come in, but now they're coming back. The Russian is coming back in the last stage of the race. This often happens in cerebral palsy races. The athletes tire up, and Neda Bahi, who had gold all the way. Look at the effort from Trushnikova. Fantastic, 105.73. It's a new championship record. Brad, just your reaction to that, because Neda Bahi seemed to have that, and then Trushnikova just came, came back so strong. Yeah, um, as you could see then, both athletes were tight, tightening up, and uh, with cerebral palsy, uh, as I know with, with having it myself, um, it's quite hard to sort of fight the spasticity and the increased tone, especially under fatigue. And, and that wind then, it sort of died down on the back straight, so they didn't have a tailwind to run with, and then it picked up as they come on to the home straight. So it was very tough conditions for them trying into that race, and uh, both goals finished well, and um, the, the Russian just ended up on top. Yeah, just explain what, what happens then to cerebral palsy runners towards the end of the race. I was working with Katrina Webb in London, a great Aussie legend, um, and she, she was saying that, particularly in a 400 metres, say for the first 300, be all right, and then suddenly the CP starts to override. Yeah, well, especially once that fatigue and lactic sets in. So when, you, when your muscles aren't getting the oxygen and uh, the nutrients that they need, they sort of start to tighten up. And with, with the already increased tone in, the, in CP muscles, I mean, if you're hemiplegic like these girls are, one side of your body really wants to tighten up while the other side's not as bad. So it's kind of hard to keep that symmetry and try to get run smooth. And, and um, as you can see, they're sort of floundering towards the end, but uh, it, it's quite it's quite very, it's quite quite very hard, I should say, to, to finish a 400 especially. So the Russian getting gold there. Championship record, 105.69. The Tunisian gets silver with a season's best, 106.23. She looked like she'd won it to me at one point, but uh, Victoria 